Welcome to Fake Breaking News. I'm your host, J. Michael Chamberlain. At a recent press briefing in the Rose Garden regarding victims of Hurricane Maria, temporary President Trump praised the president of the Virgin Islands. Unable to contain her astonishment via Trump's idiotic statement, sassy Washington correspondent Juanita Johnson exclaimed, You're the president of the Virgin Islands, you melon-headed moron. At that moment, a gust of wind elevated Trump's comb over, and he looked like an iguana with egg dripping from its face. In an unrelated story, Hollywood producer and man voted most likely to grope women in his college yearbook, Harvey Weinstein, faces an extended stay at the old Grey Bar Hotel. After decades of sexual misconduct, the pudgy producer will soon be able to watch his movies in the prison lockdown with fellow inmates Bill Cosby, Bill O'Reilly, and the bloated ghost of Roger Ailes. This, this just in, former White House strategist and man who cavorts around the house in a floral moo-moo, Steve Bannon, told reporters, and I quote, Congress will find it extremely difficult to remove the president from office. Senator Chuck Schumer responded by stating, It's only a matter of time before Chief Counsel Bob Mueller proves Trump colluded with the Russians. Then Mueller will verify that Trump isn't in fact human, but rather a subspecies like a rodent or a toxic strain of bacteria. Mmm, film at 11.